I'm so happy to see all of you. Good morning, boys and girls. So, welcome back to Learning with Miss Cheryl, and I am so excited to see all of you. But before we begin, I need you guys to stand up. Let's stand up and shake out our wiggles and our jiggles and our giggles. Are you guys ready? Okay, let's shake them off. Mm, shake them all off. Shake them all off. Get the giggles out. <laughs> Ooh, are they all out? All right, let's sit back down. Okay, are we sitting? All right, good job. So, I need you guys to turn on these listening ears and put on these looking eyes okay all right so when i point to the camera i'm going to say where is and you're going to say your name and follow the actions okay are you guys ready okay where is where is please stand up please stand up do a little wave, clap your hands, sit back down, sit back down. Yay! Great job, guys. All right, so let's move on to, who can tell me, what are these here? What are they? That's right, they are feelings. And I'm going to point to a feeling and you are going to make that face, okay? All right. This is a oh, happy face. What about this one? It's a sad face. Oh, what about this one? Oh, it's a surprise face. And what about this one? It's a angry face. Right, it's an angry face. And who remembers? What do I say about our feelings? Right? We express them in a kind way. So if you're feeling angry, do you shout and scream? No, right? You just use kind words and say, I'm not happy right now. Okay? All right. So can you guys help me sing the days of the week? All right. Let's sing together. Ready? Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. Days of the week. So if yesterday was Monday, today is, what is today? Who can tell me? That's right, it is Tuesday. Can we say Tuesday together? Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. Let's put Tuesday up on the board so we can see. Today is Tuesday. Oh, my Tuesday's not sticking. Aw, that's not fun. But we know today is Tuesday. And what, what month are we in? Does anyone know? Not February. Try again. It comes after August. Still no answer? All right, let's sing. Ready? January, February, March, and April, May, and June, and July, August, September, October, November, December. So what month came after August? That's right, September. We are in the month of September. Who knows what season we are in? Anyone know? It comes after summer. Give you a hint. Look up here, look at the decorations. What's happening up here? It's what? It's fall, that's right, fall. How do we dress for fall? 
Well, guess what? You guys can help me dress Bentley because he's still wearing his PJs. So we're going to dress him for the fall weather. What do you think we can put on him? Are we going to put shorts on him? No, that's silly. It's too cold for that. So what should we put on? Some pants. Okay, we'll put some pants on Bentley. And what else? A sweater. What about his feet? What is he missing? Right, he needs some shoes, right? Let's get him some shoes. So is Bentley dressed and ready to go? Yes, he is. He's dressed and ready for the fall season. Good job, Bentley. So, all right, guys, let's go on to our popcorn letters. All right, can you guys help me sing? Who remembers? <gasps> popcorn letters, popcorn, pop, woo! So many, but we only need one letter. Let's see, what letter do you think we'll get? I think I'm making a prediction. I think we're going to get the letter D. Let's see. Oh, no, it is. Can you guys see this letter? What letter do you see? Letter G. Good job. Letter G. Let's see what sound letter G makes. Put it inside and listen to the sound. Good. Jump. Make the sound. G says and just. So how many sounds does G make? Two. Good. G and just. So let me show you how we would write a letter G. So you can ask mom and dad for pen, paper, pencil, crayon, whatever you would like to use as your writing tools. And I'm going to show you how to write the letter G. So we start with a curved line going around and another curved line going in. And that is the letter G. Can you try it at home? All right, letter G. Let's sing our alphabet. Are you guys ready? All right, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Yay! You guys are doing such an awesome job. Guys, look what I have here. Do you guys know what these are called? When it's just one, it's called a die. When it's two, it's called dice. I have some dice. What do we do with the dice? That's right, we roll them. So on the dice are little dots. So we're gonna roll them and see how many dots we're gonna get. Are you guys ready? Let's see. Oh, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight dots. Oh, who knows what the number eight looks like? Ah, do you know what that is? Number eight. Good job. So we counted to number eight. All right. Who remembers our friend Pointer? And what's Pointer's job? To pick a shape. That's right. So I'm going to close my eyes 
and pointers and a pretty shape. Okay? Okay. Do you point to pick a shape? Oh, and what shape is that? Who remembers what shape this is? It's a hexagon. Can you say hexagon? Good. So let's count and see how many sides the hexagon has. Are you ready? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. A hexagon has six sides. Isn't that awesome? Maybe you guys can try in your home and look for anything that's shaped like a hexagon or even on a ride. If you're driving in the car, try and look for the shape. I've seen that shape on plenty of signs. All right, guys, so now that we have talked about our feelings, we know today is Tuesday, we know the month is September, we know this is letter G, Bentley is dressed for what season? Fall, good. We counted number eight. We learned that this is a hexagon. <gasps> what can we do next? Our colors, that's right. So I want you guys to follow my instructions, okay? I need to know that you are listening. Good. So if you are wearing any of the colors that I point to, you are going to clap your hands, okay? All right. What did I say? That's right. Clap your hands. So Michelle, I'm going to move all the way over to the colors. If you are wearing the color... Red, that's right, clap your hands. How about this color? Orange, clap your hands. Who's wearing this color? Blue, oh, I'm wearing blue, I have to what? Clap my hands. What about this color? It's yellow. You should be clapping your hands. What color is this? White, good job. What about this color? Pink. Oh, my favorite color. So you should be clapping your hands if you're wearing that color. How about this color? This is green. Good. Purple. Who's wearing gray? Anyone wearing gray? Good job. I see you clapping your hands. And this color is turquoise. Can you say turquoise? Good job. Clap your hands if you're wearing turquoise. Brown. I'm wearing brown. I have to clap my hands. And who's wearing the color black? Good job. Give yourself a pat on the back for doing such a good job and following the directions. So since we are learning about fall, I have a poem that we can sing together. You guys ready to say it? We can say it and we can sing it. So let's say it first. Ready? Leaves are falling. Leaves are falling from the trees. From the trees. Red and yellow, orange and brown. In the breeze. In the breeze. So we said it. Now let's sing it. Are you guys ready? One, two, three. Leaves are falling, leaves are falling from the trees, from the trees. Red and yellow, orange and brown in the breeze, in the breeze. So not only can we say words, we can sing words. You guys are doing such an awesome job listening and paying attention. Makes me so happy. So guys, now that we have talked about our feelings, we know today is Tuesday, the month is September. We learned that this is letter G. We dress Bentley for the season fall. We counted to number eight. We learned about the hexagon, who has six sides, and we 
clapped our hands to show the colors we are wearing. I'd like you guys to stand up so we can sing a song. Are you guys ready? All right. All right. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! Hooray! If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! Hooray! Yay! You guys did such an awesome job! I'm so proud of all of you. Give your hands a round of applause. Yay! So when we hear that sound, that means learning with Miss Sherelle is over until tomorrow. Okay guys, I see you again tomorrow. It was fun. Bye!